Hi there. Now, while it certainly is a challenge to find the best tools that are worthy of your hard-earned money, it isn't impossible, especially when you have a reliable source like our channel to point you in the right direction and show you the brands you can trust. Now, in preparing this list, we reviewed literally dozens of products and we based our rankings on a number of factors, including the features of the product, value for money, and the reputation of the manufacturer. We even read countless reviews from actual users. If you choose from this list, you can be sure you'll be buying one of the best tools available today. And make sure to check the product links down below in the description. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. So, let's get started. Hey everybody, it's Phil with Behringer. How are you doing today? Welcome to Music Group Studios. I want to talk to you today about the Virtualizer 3D, which is also called the FX2000. So the FX2000 is like having a whole guitar pedal board or effects rack from a studio right in a one unit piece of gear. And it's really cool because it does so many things. It's got reverbs and delays and choruses, so it has all the gain pitched time stuff in there. It has uh, amplifier simulation and all kinds of psychoacoustics. So the way it works is there's 71 different algorithms that you can choose from and yet you can store these in a hundred different locations. So let's talk about some of the algorithms and things. The FX2000 uses real sound modeling, so it'll get you everything from straightforward delay to like a real surreal kind of 3D kind of aspect thing going on, which is going to be great live or in the studio. There's great modulation, dynamic, psychoacoustic, and EQ algorithms built in that's going to give you a really huge sound and with different stereo and mono algorithms that are going to work together. It's really cool. Now you have 11 effect combinations you can choose from which can either be serial or parallel effects and you have seven different items that you can adjust per algorithm and you also get a two band EQ on each patch. You're going to have pristine sound because on the way in and on the way out the A to D converters and D to A converters are 24 bit. It's going to be nice and clean and it's also 64 to 128 times over sampling so you're going to have a nice, great signal to apply all these effects to. Inside it is true stereo processing, so it's not trying to make it processing, it is stereo processing, which is going to give you a great stereo and 3D image. Now right out of the box, you have 100 factory presets to choose from, which is going to cover a wide array of effects. Now, as you're going through those 100 presets, you can also store 100 presets. So if you find one you like, you can change it a little bit, edit it, and store it as your own. So you have 100 factory presets and 100 presets that you can make of your own. That's a lot of flexibility. Now, on the back of the FX2000 are MIDI ports. And this means that you can have a lot of MIDI control of the patches. And you can also do sysx dumps of your presets as well, so that you can pull them up at any time via MIDI or from the front panel makes it nice. All of the inputs and outputs, whether they're XLR or quarter inch, are servo balance, so you're going to get a great signal strength in and out of the unit. It's real important to have that. So this is the FX2000. For more information and media, please feel free to come visit us at Behringer.com. Thanks for joining us here at Music Group Studios. with an acoustic guitar, you can sound better right now with Play Acoustic from TC Helicon. Just connect your vocal mic and your guitar to the single pedal and you'll get that polished, professional sound you've been searching for. It starts with your virtual vocal harmony backup group. Imagine an extra two singers ready to sing when you want them to. They listen to your guitar chords so they're always in tune and on time with you. And to add some space around your vocals, Play Acoustic has a pristine reverb effect that fills out your sound like a finely tuned concert hall. Can you my voice above all the rest? It's being silenced by your noise, I should have guessed. Even your dry voice sounds better 
with TC Helicon's trademark adaptive tone. Subtle studio magic takes your voice from plain to CD ready and all you have to do to set it up is, well, nothing. It's always on, adapting to your voice so you sound brighter, tighter and more produced. Play Acoustic's built-in guitar effects feature sounds from TC Electronics' famous line of tone print pedals, Hall of Fame Reverb and Corona Chorus. And when you want to get loud, the anti-feedback controls help keep guitar feedback from ruining your performance. Have you ever noticed when you amplify your acoustic guitar, it just doesn't sound or feel the same when you're playing to the PA as when you're playing and hanging out in your living room? Well, Play Acoustic has body res that helps overcome that quacky synthetic sound so you can get a fuller, more acoustic tone when you're playing through a PA. Flexible outputs let you choose between an immersive stereo mix of guitar and vocals or separate mono guitar DI and affected vocals for your sound tech to mix. It even works as a USB audio interface so you can record your performances. And speaking of recording, the onboard stereo looper lets you create accompaniments for fun jams and performances. There are tons of useful factory presets to get you up and running quickly and there's more available free online. Whether you play coffee shops or concert halls, Play Acoustic will always help you sound your best. Okay guys, uh, let's see the new one from the top. my footsteps and you watch me approach but I knew you'd use me like you did before I saw the weakness in your smile so cold like all the games that you play TA1VP vocal processor, co-developed with Antares Audio Technologies, brings together everything needed for a polished modern vocal sound. This easy-to-use rack mount processor includes a high-quality microphone preamp with Antares microphone and tube modeling, along with built-in compression, de-essing, and the Antares world-famous auto-tune pitch correction. Ideal for live performance, house of worship, or studio use, the TA-1VP brings your vocal sound into the 21st century.
Designed as a tool to allow a vocalist to get the correct pitch, many users have discovered that the TA-1VP can be set up to create the glitchy vocal effect used by many popular hip-hop, dance, and R&B artists. Because the TA-1VP processes in real time, this effect can be used for live performance as well as studio sessions. In this video, we will demonstrate setting up the TA-1VP to achieve this effect. Ideally, the TA-1VP should be connected as an insert effect on the vocalist's mixer channel. Using a standard Y-type insert cable, connect the TA-1VP to the mixer. This cable has a single quarter-inch TRS connector at one end and two quarter-inch TS connections at the other. Connect the two quarter-inch TS connectors to the TA-1VP with the tip or send connector going to the TA-1VP's input and the ring or receive connector to the TA-1VP's output. Connect the quarter-inch TRS connector to the vocalist's mixer channel. The mixer channel's preamp trim control can be used to set the input gain to the TA-1VP. Alternatively, if the mixer does not have channel inserts, the front panel microphone connector can be used and the TA-1VP's output connected to a line level input on the mixer. After verifying connections, set the input on the TA-1VP. Since we are using the insert cable, set the input for line. Press Setup, followed by Page. When the input select display appears, rotate the data knob until the display indicates line. Press Setup to exit and save the choice. Setting up the effect. Begin by selecting a preset, such as male voice. Press the preset button and rotate the data knob until the desired preset appears in the display. In the Auto-Tune control section, switch Auto-Tune correction on. Next, press scale. The display indicates CH for chromatic scale, along with a series of notes. If it does not, rotate the data knob counterclockwise until CH appears in the display's upper left-hand corner. Use the cursor left-right buttons to select the notes and rotate the data knob to turn them off. Try switching off all but a pentatonic scale, such as C, D-sharp, F, G, and A-sharp. Now press the speed button. Speed determines how rapidly pitch correction is applied to the incoming sound. For this effect, rotate the data knob to zero to cause instantaneous changes from one note to another. To save the new preset, press Save. At the prompt, give the preset a unique name by using the left-right cursor buttons to move between characters and the data knob to change them. Press Save twice to save the new preset. To call up this new effect, simply turn on the auto-tune function using the front panel controls. Alternatively, MIDI signals or a foot switch connected to the TA-1VP can be configured to control the effect. The compressor, equalizers, and de can also be used to enhance this effect. For more information, refer to the TA-1VP owner's manual. The TA-1VP Vocal Processor from Tascam. Everything you need to create stunning vocal tracks in any musical style. The VT4 is an effects processor for your voice. It can do a ton of cool stuff, and I'm just going to show you how I use it in my setup. The first thing I really love about it is its ability to communicate uh, via MIDI and harmonize your voice. So I have it hooked up to the System 8, and I'm using this to give information to the VT4 to tell it what chords I want it to play. you can balance how much of the effect um, and how much of your natural voice is coming through. So if I wanted to be able to sing a line over the chords I'm playing and have that really be prevalent, I can just go ahead and turn the balance down and you'll be able to hear my voice coming through the harmony.
What I love about this is that there are no menus. So everything is very tactile. What you see is what you get. Um, if you want to change something, it's as easy as, you know, turning this knob or removing the slider. So it's very intuitive and very easy to kind of create something really special live and not have to go through and program everything and have it all laid out beforehand. An effect I like to use a lot is the pitch shift. I like to use my voice as a bass, um, and I'm using this looper here, so it's really easy to kind of use my voice as all of the instruments. Um, so what I like to do is shift my voice all the way down an octave and then switch the formant to something warmer to give it a nice resonance and a nice beefiness. <laughs> I like to use the megaphone effect to give my voice kind of that lo-fi quality. Um, and the cool thing about all of these effects is that there are multiple versions of each one. So there's multiple megaphones, multiple types of harmonies and vocoder sounds. Um, so you can really be creative and really kind of customize every sound to your liking. And you can use these buttons up here to customize what type of effect is on the slider. So you can do a delay, a reverb, a chorus, um, whatever you want, you can change it to be exactly what you need. So I like taking multiple effects and combining them to create a really unique sound and then save it as a preset so that I have it when I want to go play. So I want to start with just a simple harmony. Cool, I like that. So now I want to add some space. So maybe I'll add a little bit of delay here. Now, let's say like while I'm performing, I want to do a cool pitch sweep or something. Um, I can easily do that with this fader over here. So now I have an effect that I'm happy with and I want to save it. All I have to do is come over here, press and hold a button, and it will save as a preset just like on your car stereo. Oh, 
heart fact that I am not the one you love. 